is First Lieutenant Lauren Bell. I am from Dawsonville, Georgia. I'm stationed at Joint Base Lewis McCord, Washington at Madigan Army Medical Center. I hope to become an ICU nurse and then after that become a nurse anesthetist. My mother was also a nurse and um, she served in the Army back in the early 90s and it just kind of drove me just to find my interest in the medical field and I, I have found that caring for people has definitely become my passion. Second Lieutenant Caroline Vining, I am from Annapolis, Maryland and I am currently stationed at Fort Bragg, North Carolina, working at Wimac Army Medical Center. I eventually hoped to become a nurse practitioner. At first, when I got to college, I had no idea I wanted to be an Army nurse. I, my family has a very strong background in medical, but no one is in the service. So um, what caught my attention first was a recruitment tent, and I started talking to the Army recruitment, and I decided it was something that um, I was drawn to specifically because I want to serve my country and also um, I'm very involved in fitness and I thought that aspect was cool as well. Each day we seem to be doing something a little bit different. We may be vaccinating on the floor for 12 hours. We may be in the pharmacy pulling up medications. We may be the disability tent officer in charge. What I find most rewarding is interacting with the patients or the clients that we see every day. Um, the people of Chicago have been very thankful that we've been here. We have been able to vaccinate over 250,000 people so far. So when we say that number, people get emotional, people get excited just to continue with their lives and see their families. Um, back home at Madigan, I work on the COVID unit. It had recently converted to the COVID unit when I became a new nurse. Um, and so my life as a nurse has been all during the pandemic. Um, and just being able to interact with patients on a different level, being that person there for them, even when their family members aren't able to come and visit and just being able to provide that support um, solely as the nurse in the room.